Hello, my crafty friends. I'm so glad to be back with you again today. This is Mary, and you're watching Cards TV. We're going to make a get well card today for a dear friend of mine who's facing some really serious health challenges right now. And I didn't want to send her a serious card. I wanted to send her a cute card to maybe put a smile on her face. So we're going to use Elegant Edges, the Teddy Bear Parade cartridge. Our papers will come from this Lawn Fawn Petite Paper Pack. And this one's called Dewey Decimal. And my good friend Kim from Sunshine Creations and Crafts sent me this. And I love it. It's got some really neat colors and patterns and you can use this for feminine cards or masculine cards and we'll be using the cards tv mixed messages stamp set for our sentiments and we're going to use doctor's orders feel better soon and better get better i'll get this moved out of the way and we'll get started on my friends get well card my card base is four and a quarter by five and a half when folded it's white on top of that I'm going to add this herringbone layer, and I love this color. It's kind of a teal blue, and I'll have all the dimensions and the cut sizes as well as the supplies that I used at the end of the video if you're interested in copying that down and maybe recreating this card. So we'll get that on our card base. Then we've got a white border, and on top of that I've got this uh, brown and teal polka dot paper which is also from that paper pad and I'm going to adhere that right over here kind of close to the top and close to the side so I'll get my adhesive and get all this stuck down and then I'll show you what comes next now we've got our card base all ready and I wanted to have a mat for my little teddy bear so I've cut a white shadow and then this is another paper from that paper pad. I love this. It kind of looks like bricks on an angle and it's that same pretty teal color. And I cut both of these from the Elegant Edges cartridge. And that is on page 24. I cut this pretty paper right here using the oblong. I hit shift and oblong. And then the white shadow, I hit shift and shadow to cut that. And I'm going to get these adhered together. And we're going to get this right here on the front of our card. And this is also going to go up kind of close to the top of our polka dot paper and closer to the right side of the card. I love these papers and colors together. Now we're ready to add our teddy bear from the Teddy Bear Parade cartridge. And he comes from the last column, and he is the second cut. There he is right there. Now, to do this teddy bear, the first thing you want to do is go to your teddy bear, which is the first column and the first cut, and get your bear put together. And you can see here are all the layers that you'll need. And then you want to come over here to this second cut in the last column, and here's his scrubs. Now, I did not cut the little chart that he's holding, if you can see that right there. I didn't cut the skeleton, or the rib cage, I guess it is. I did cut the stethoscope. That is hard to say. <laughs> and I didn't use this heart. It's kind of wonky, and I wanted a heart with a little bit better shape. So, I just used my Studio G small heart punch. And I'll show you where I'm going to use that in just a minute. So you can see the layers here, and you would hit layer, shift layer, you know, just whatever you need to cut the different layers that you want. And let me show you my teddy bear. He's so cute. He's a little teddy bear doctor. He's got his scrubs on and his stethoscope, and he's got a mask. Now I've got him on some foam tape, and I'm going to put him right about there make sure I get him straight and where I've decided to put one of the little hearts that I cut if I can pick it up these hearts are tiny I wanted a little pop of red but I wanted the heart on his scrubs instead of a little chart so I'm gonna add that right there 
with my two-way glue pen. Now for my sentiment down here, for the front of my card, for mixed messages, we're using doctor's orders, feel better soon. And I have already cut out a little banner and I stamped that using Memento Tuxedo Black Ink. This is also on some foam tape. And I'm going to put that right down here. And I stamped or punched another little heart. And I'm going to put this right here on my banner with that two-way glue pen. So I'm going to go ahead and finish getting this adhered down, and then we're going to do the inside. I think that's so cute. I love it. And we're going to use a wink of Stella, too, to uh, give some little sparkle and shine to our hearts. So I'm going to go ahead and get those adhered, and I'll come right back. Okay, everything's adhered down to the front. I just think that's so cute. I hope it'll put a smile on my friend's face. Now let's do the inside. If I can get it open. Here we go. All I did was cut a rectangle out of that teal herringbone pattern and then one out of the brown and teal polka dot. I'm going to put that right there. Then I went back to the Elegant Edges cartridge and I cut another scalloped oblong from page 24. And I've gone ahead and stamped it with that Better Get Better from the Mixed Messages Cards TV stamp set. And that's going to go right there. And I've got another little heart that I'm going to add. Let me grab my tweezers. These little hearts are hard to get a hold of. And I'm going to add that right there. So I'll get this all adhered down. And we'll come back and take a look at this finished Get Well card. Here's my finished card, guys. And I'm going to go ahead and add some Wink of Stella to these hearts. Just give it a little bit of sparkle and shine. And it does make the hearts just a little bit darker, too. I really like using this. And I'm going to do the one on the inside as well. But I wanted to go ahead and show you how that looked. Don't know if you can see that sparkle, but it's really cute. And it adds so much to a card. So we've got this cute little teddy bear doctor. Doctor's orders, feel better soon. And then on the inside, better get better. And I've got plenty of room to write an additional sentiment and sign my name. Thank you so much for coming by today, guys. I hope you had fun and enjoyed this video. And I will see you again soon with another card. Bye now.